This is how the first of the confirmation hearings for Donald Trump's cabinet choices started. Protesters heckling Jeff Sessions, Trump's pick for attorney general. The Alabama senator has a history of controversial views on minorities' immigration and justice reform. Now he's in the spotlight, in particular to defend a career blighted by claims of racism. I deeply understand the history of civil rights in our country and the horrendous impact that relentless and systemic discrimination and the denial of voting rights has had on our African-American brothers and sisters. I have witnessed it. We must continue to move forward and never back. The first session will be followed on Wednesday by up to five hearings. They include that of Russia-friendly former ExxonMobil boss Rex Tillerson, Trump's choice for Secretary of State. Commerce Secretary Pick and billionaire investor Wilbur Ross Jr. is also set to go before Congress. Democrats want to block a whopping nine cabinet appointments made by Trump. And that's not all. The Senate's top Democrat is seeking a delay in the confirmation hearings for the cabinet nominees. To spend an extra day or two on each nominee, even if it takes a few weeks to get through them all in order to carefully consider their nominations, that is well worth it. That's important. Trump's confident his picks will be confirmed on Capitol Hill before his inauguration on the 20th of January.